we went for a day trip from Toronto to the spectacular region that has 997 islands officially. This is an amazing place for outdoor adventures and offers serene views especially during summer and fall. Let's explore Thousand Islands. Hi, this is Manoj Kumar Sundar and welcome to my channel. Firstly, we headed to the Thousand Islands Tower, a scenic observation tower located on the hill island. We took the elevator to reach the top of the tower. There are two levels of uh, observation deck to enjoy breathtaking views. The first level is partially enclosed while the second level is completely open to air. The panoramic views of many islands that dot the landscape with St. Lawrence River streaming through them is simply amazing. attraction in Thousand Islands are their boat cruises. These cruises are by City Cruises by Hornblower that set sail from two spots, Ivy Lee and Gananoque. We chose the one hour cruise from Ivy Lee as this location is 5-10 minutes away from the tower. We were on board throughout this cruise that explores four different spots. If you plan to get off board and visit the castle, make sure you have necessary travel and immigration documents as this castle is in the part of the US. A few interesting facts about this region. This region has a unique border that divides the United States and Canada with approximately two-thirds of the islands belonging to the United States and just one-third to Canada. This region also houses one of the shortest international bridge located at Zavicon Islands. Many of the islands in the regions are privately owned and include beautiful cottages and estates. Some can be rented for vacation, offering unique getaway experience. If you found this video useful, please hit the like button and share your thoughts about this place. Don't forget to subscribe. Until next time, it's me Manoj Kumar Sundar signing off. Have a wonderful day. Thank you.